Four people facing charges in the deaths of two Mississippi police officers will appear in court today. Two officers were gunned down Saturday night after what began as a routine traffic stop. CBS 4's Rhiannon Alley has more from Mississippi. Yeah, what's happening there? The community gathered last night for a candlelight vigil to remember the officers. They'll also gather later today for a memorial service. Now, one of the things that makes these killings so hard for this town is the fact that officers Dean and Tate are the first Hattiesburg officers killed in the line of duty in more than 30 years. Four suspects in the murder of two Hattiesburg, Mississippi police officers are due in court today. Marvin Banks and Joni Calloway are charged with two counts of capital murder. Cornelius Clark is charged with obstruction of justice. And Curtis Banks, Marvin's younger brother, is facing accessory charges. I don't think I took the test, sir. God knows I ain't needing nothing. The shooting began after a traffic stop Saturday night. Officer Benjamin Dean pulled over a gold Cadillac Escalade for speeding. He called for backup, and rookie officer LaCorey Tate responded. I was upstairs in my kitchen, and we heard, I heard six loud gunshots. 34-year-old Dean and 25-year-old Tate were rushed to the hospital, but did not survive. Too much blood was lost, uh, and too much damage done uh, internally. Officer Tate's father wrote on Facebook, Well, Lord, I have been praying that it was all just a mistake. My baby, I just need some kind of mercy right now. Both of these, uh, these men leave to mourn uh, their parents. Uh, Officer Dean also leaves uh, uh, to mourn his, uh, his wife and uh, two small children. A memorial event is scheduled for those two slain officers today at 1 o'clock, and the four arrested are expected in court. Rhiannon Alley, CBS 4 News. So